Hello everybody, welcome to another Brain Dash 99's Game Quest video recording. This week's video is from uh, is versus myself and Nate, also known as Warfather on uh, Card Game DB and Octagon. Nate's playing a Space Marine Tau deck. I am playing uh, my Kith deck. Actually, this is a Kith. Eldar deck, not Kith Chaos. So I was trying that out uh, for the first time in a long while. Um, as we jump into the game, the planet layout is first planet Taurus with Nate having initiative, second planet Osis 4, third planet Farron, fourth planet Illoweth, and fifth planet is Barless. Uh, the first win based on those planets, um, first planet win at least, would be Barless. We both keep our hands. And Nate plays Earthcast Technician on Planet 5. As one hammer, it's 1 1. Search top six cards of your deck for an attachment. He searches out his Tempest Blade, which is a very good attachment. Um, it's a signature attachment for Kato. Gives him Armor Bane. And plus one attack, so he'd be swinging for three. Armor Bane, I play a Warlock Destructor on Planet One for two resources. Nate plays his Tempest Blade on to Kato for one, leave him with a five. I have five resources left as well. Play a Void Pirate on Planet Three. And one command on Planet One and three so far. Nate has a Void Pirate in hand, he plays on planet four. I can test command there with my Kif's Chimera Masters. I have two resources left it looks like, and Nate has four. It has a second earth cast technician. We have a little buzzer problem there. Somebody's buzzer's going off and nobody's claiming it. Nate plays his earth cast technician on planet three. Searches another top six cards for an attachment. Grabs out uh, uh, Halo. I'll put it on the video. Iron Halo, so basically it's just two shield. You can only have, you can only have one relic at a time, and that's usually used as a shield. Don't listen to Nate, he's joking around. I play Archon's Palace, my last play of the turn, unless I have a promotion. I'm probably going to show the two cards at the last planet. He promotes at planet four, he's going to command there now. Going into this, Nate's going to command on. Planet 4 and 5. We put a signature unit on Planet 2, pulling over my Warlock Destructor, which is really annoying. One of the strongest signature units, in my, in my opinion. Going to the dials. Nate went to one, I went to four. It'd be silly for me to kind of contest him with his Tempest Blade there. Number Bane. He takes one and one. We push up next opponents. I take three cards, or two cards. Alright, two cards. I turn off your two cards. It's a pretty even command phase there. Nate has less units um, than me at this point, so he's able to trigger Taurus. Down here. If I would not have created my token, I could have pushed, which would have been a better play there. 
that I did not count prior to generating my token. That's it's not mandatory to generate your token, so it's a reaction, which is optional. Uh, LOF I trigger, which is to look at top three and pick a card. So that round could have went better for me. Flip over Prime, Aatrox Prime, which is the bane of Kith. Especially. Well, I guess I'm, I am running an Eldar ally, so I do have Fortel in the deck, which is nice. I'm at 4 money, Nate's at 5. I pay 1 to keep my Destructor. Incubus Warrior on Planet 4. Trumpet Command there for the moment. It spins 2. Um, play a Stronghold. So he has a signature location out. I promote at Planet 2 when he command there now. Stronghold is a very good location. Um, let you stand up a space marine unit after you destroy a unit at that planet. I believe is the wording. I'll put the wording on the screen, the actual wording, but that's basically the effect. Knights play with three money left. Looks like I have one. Yeah, be thinking. Nate has to be thinking that I have a mercenary. That one I spends all three for a Blood Angels veteran. Or actually, I apologize. This is another one of the same units. He brings it. My instructor over to Planet Two again, clearing his way for Planet One win. That's really annoying. Thinking the only thing I could be thinking about really is a Slift Mercenary. I've already promoted, so I can't raid. I pass. I'll go to the dials. Again, it'd be pretty silly to go to one. I assume he go to one. Space Marines are really good at bullying those early planets and. Big units, big tough units. Luckily, they're generally pretty expensive. Problem with the Kato Kith matchup is he's able to destroy my tokens and make money off of them. And I go to two, I don't want to face him at one. You don't want to give Kato money if you can stop it. My goal is in most matches is to win command as much as possible. And Choke them the resources and money, or um, cards or resources, and generally here is going to be cards. So he can generate his own money. Osis 4, which is taking money from me. So now I believe I have two money, two or three, and he has one. I can't tell from the screen. Uh, here, I'll pass. Okay. I want to put damage on a Space Marine because um, he can give him a stand up after he kills a unit. Does shield two, takes one. <laughs> I'm 
chastising about actions. Yeah, I need a three, uh, two shield to save the Chimera. One money left. A little scout coming. That's fine. That's my chance. He could have stood up his... I can't remember his name, Sig Unit, but he chose not to. This is a two shield. Save his... 1-1, one, one. Earth Gas Ignition, drops the scout in for the 1. Uh oh. And I decided to terror. Instead of letting my destructor die. Switch so front the pirate, I'll use a superiority. That's with the zero. You're talking. Nate just realized he could have radiated the Space Marine unit after he killed the token, but he missed it. Again, it's all about the low mistakes. That would have been actually pretty huge to the planet. Now he has to take two damage come or three damage coming in. Another true shield. There's one health left on that. Okay. He swings for two at my warlord. Be nice for a doom. Actually, it would be. Yeah, I probably would doom that. Do get my resources out of it. Planum is the fifth planet, or seventh planet, I should say. It came up fifth in the game right now. It's a green blue. Pay for him. for Honor Liberian at Prime. I play a Void Pirate at Platinum, Platinum 5. He has one resource left. I have two. And I play a Sith Mercenary, Trumping Prime. So Nate has a red, green, and a green so far. His win right now is Barless, which is the green. Which is still three planets away. I went to Prime, Planet 4, and Nate went to Planet 1. It's a red, would be his second red Farron. Language. Give her all your cards. Uh, 
like guitar, yeah. money. Uh, I feel like it uses. I just cleaned up our command there. Three out, three armor bane. Can't do anything about that to his instructor. He readies Kato again with the Kato stronghold. Pirate. Kills the pirate. He has three money. Any actions? Nope. Let's go trigger Farron. And that foretell it. So that would have been, he would have been able to route somebody with Farron, but I stopped it. Probably would have routed it. Uh, well, sorry, so. He gives the word, maybe, or somebody at Prime. He shields my two damage to the uh, Barbarian action to me. Probably a Terror coming in. My second Archon's Terror. Don't want to take four damage on my Warlord. I trigger Prime to put one damage to everybody at his headquarters. It's nice. Gives me a lot of uh, targets with my War Leader. Since they have a damage already on them. Some weird background noise going on there. It's a, it's a very busy night at the event center. Um, I think there was 25 people playing Game of Thrones version 2.0, which I am also into playing. I'm not nearly. Well, I just started playing it, but it's um, it's a different beat, beast in conquest, totally. It's a fun game, though. We lost our first planet token here. I'm looking for it. Sirens that flex at Planet One. I love that lady. Even though Tempest Blade could just wreck face with wreck her face. He spins three. Another stick unit, maybe? Nope. Um, the Bikers. Space Marine Groupie. Warlord Groupie. So they get plus two attack on the same planet with the Warlord. I believe their stats are two, three. I'll put that up in the video. I'm pretty sure they're two, three. So they're swinging for four. I put a Destructor down at Prime. It's obvious he's trying to go there. Trigger, trigger Prime and get my Chimeras. He plays a Trailblazer at planet four. I trump. Um, with the promotion there, command. Buys. Not mercenaries for two. I imagine I'll probably go to Prime. I don't know. Um, I have initiative, which is nice. I'm not worried about one too much. I do go to Prime. Nate goes to Prime. It's gonna be the big fight. So I get two cards. One. Surprised Nate not is then it focus more on Barless, since that would have been his win planet. 
looks like he decided to go off to the Reds for a win. Probably because he can. I won't command by the superiority. Again, just try and choke him as much as possible. Or attack him in, I guess. I realized something at that point, but I don't remember what I realized. I win Elowith. It's my first planet, which is blue. It means I can't win to Planum. Last planet, which is whoever was the last planet. If there's not one by that point, it's a winner anyway, so. There's an advantage there. I only have one money, Nate has zero. Right now he'll have plenty once he kills. He'll get up to three once he kills my three units there. Swing for two at the mercenary, he lets it go. Swings for my token. Skipped a little a few seconds there. With the bikers, it looks like. I'll try to swing at my at his iron librarian because I'm having a brain fart there. Saving me here is that Nate doesn't have many cards in his hand. Obviously, he doesn't, uh, doesn't have enough shields. Yeah. Pretty much just want to do enough damage, as much damage as I can. Same time. So, man, has 
a regular green and red. I have a blue. Barless, the first player here is a green. It's looking like Prime's going to be the first real one planet. It's a red, blue. I pass it for. Pretty telltale sign that I have a destructor. I want to make sure I can trigger. And he does put a trailblazer at one. One. I go to one. Just because I was made to one time. his prime. So I got to my warlord. But that point doesn't mean that much. Well, she was still being killed. Draw a card? Oh, no. You want me to draw my cards? I think I'll be fine, so I don't know. I guess I'll draw a card up front. How many do I have left? I drew a card from the fourth tone, and I drew two cards. I just count out that I have only six cards left. Now I have four cards left after this headquarters phase. And then I have two cards left if you go to plan them. So I can't take that, start taking the bonuses. So the deal with that is you have to, you can choose not to take your card or your resource bonus, but you have to take, choose not to take all of it. So if I have a white card giving me one more card, Planet. That means I gotta go two cards. I can't take one card. Um, let's add it all in the same bonus. So you gotta stop it. You gotta choose all together. The only thing saving me in this game is the amount of hard to be able to draw on the shields I have. Plays a tactical squad Carnus. One AoE, which is also the bane of Kith. First time I've seen this game, so we must have two more. Only has one card left though. Uh, or EB at 5 money, I'd be at 4 money. I 
trying to do the math here. You know, like most other stuff. I go back to my world. Work. Nate must have Nate had initial. Okay, that's why he got the choice first. Finally, this word goes away. Let's just clean up at this point. I just have to show these guys more. You know, I know I have kind of one, so they're going to come in the next battle. Two shield, stop one damage. And then I'm able to kill these last two guys. I take prime. So now I have a red. Okay. These guys are on my headquarters in case I'm out. Your initiative. And Kato has damage on him and then try to kill the squad and damage on him. Nice cards undrawn. Potential for leader we got him. This is both our wind planet. This is by virtue of being the last planet. I guess also by planet colors because I have, have a red blue, you know, blue. This would be a green blue. They place a sig unit, can't bring anybody over. Options. The only thing I actually have right now at that planet is the Void Power, I believe. For simplicity's sake, we just might also have one of the kit commanders, which I'm not sure. Raid, not five money. Saving that. And Nate saves. Put a suffering onto a sig unit, make it a zero attack. Yeah, it's the only thing I had there was my boy power with the promotion on Generate a chimera, everything else is just tapped. So it's looking pretty good for me at this point, unless you're able to get. No, fine. Oh, it looks like. Oh, that's a uh, primal how, so make it to draw three cards, which is nice. Best chance here is to kill one of my guys, stand at the top of the squad, oh, uh, blow the planet I'll up with the one AOE. Yeah. So you can't make it go more far. Uh, as soon as you, you're out, you lose. I know. You, you can't choose to. Oh, half it. Right. Half it. I'll take it one time. I almost killed. I almost lost the game there, but. That's right. That's, that, I think that's a really. I can't take. Yeah, I have to do the full ball. I know that. I think, you can I think you can. I think, but I think, I think if you pick one, you have to take a full bonus of all your stuff. Yeah. That is action, sir. True. I pass on action. Pass. Why Nate had issue with both last planet and this planet? Maybe I missed something. Yeah, it's a mistake. It's not going to do me any good. So, I'm tap him. I guess I. So, Nate knows I have a ward in my hand. Actually, I Chooses to tap Kato. It's my swing. He has no cards in hand. Or he has one card, but. That's what it's for Kato. I'm kind of bloody sick. You didn't pull any shields off those three cards? I did. Do you know why you didn't? Hopefully you get them. Oh, drop pod. It's Nate search out for a cat to go swat that. I have a card if he pulls one. I got one in my hand. So you only have a, you have a small chance. Oh, shit. Then he grabs the Liberian. That's his best choice. Just not gonna here, be enough. You'll easily put the three put there and yeah. He calls it that point. Just you went hardcore. I've been, been playing Space Marines. I forgot how like vicious they are just grabbing planets. And that would be my 
Oh, and thank you guys for watching. Um, if you enjoyed the game, me and Nate played another game uh, that night. I believe that game was the my same Kif deck against Kif Kif deck. You were able to move my board and start the down Thanks, guys. Yeah, but the entire time I had, had not had enough command that you completely blocked everything. Any time, right? So that's what gets you when I have a rip full of cards. When um, anytime you start with Tempest Blade, though, it's not. I mean, it's, you were competitive. It's not like it wasn't competitive. It's not yeah. like it, right. I mean, you definitely had a really good shot of winning that.